All righty. Hello, 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 hello. Welcome in, everyone. Welcome. How are we doing? Doing good? All right. I'm doing good. <laughs> good to can hear. You listen to me properly? Yeah. Yeah, I can hear you. Awesome. Good to hear. Thank you. All right. So, um, welcome to the Q&A with Project SNT. Um, Cookie and I will be handling uh, this hosting duty. So um, feel free to raise your hands and ask questions. Um, just some regular rules and stuff going around. Keep everything family friendly. Um, just follow normal panel etiquette. Don't self-promote. Don't role play as a character when coming up to ask a question. Please have your questions ready um, when you are called up. Um, if you have anything to add on Project s &T, go on ahead. Uh, make sure your mic is working. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, there's a few tricks of, uh, with Discord that I can employ if, if something goes something goes wrong. Um, but anyway, uh, welcome in. Do you want to just go uh, introduce yourself? Oh, gosh. Uh, I'm bad at that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, hi, I'm Courtney, also known as Project s and I do stuff on YouTube. I make videos. I stream. Uh, most, I'm mostly known for my my silly little OC s and um, <laughs> And yeah. <laughs> All right. Um. So with that out of the way, I guess we can go into some questions. Cookie, do you have any questions for SNT before we start? Of course. Um, first and foremost, huge fan of your work. <laughs> oh, so, thank you. Um, how do you start this whole thing of your own alternate universe? How did it start? It? Uh, uh, hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sure how to answer that question. <laughs> Uh, I don't know. I, I've i always liked playing with uh, my characters and uh, doing different things with them. And uh, and one day I just did it. <laughs> I don't I don't know how to answer this question. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's just my my creative process is just like, that sounds like fun. I'm going to do it. And then I do. <laughs> Excellent. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> How about you, Daya? Do you have a question for SNT? Yeah. Um, so, when you went about creating your character, uh, what kind of like design ideas did you have when creating it? Uh, you mean SNT? Yeah. Mm, uh, well, I've had her for a very long time. So, when I first designed her, I was just like. I don't know any Sonic characters that have ponytails, so I'm going to give her a ponytail. This was before Blaze was a thing. Ah, um, uh, I gotcha. Yeah. Uh, she, oh, it was, it's been so long. <laughs> <laughs> I made her when I was like 10 years old. Um, but then when it came to like redesigning her for the, the modern day, um, you know, I, I took some inspiration from like the many different uh, iterations that I have drawn of her over the years and I kind of like smushed them together. I smushed the pieces that I liked together and I also like uh, designing clothes for her. She has many outfits um, <laughs> as people might know. Uh, uh, yeah, I, I just I, I put together what I personally think is aesthetically pleasing um <laughs> yeah i guess that's it <laughs> <laughs> all right I'm, I'm just always curious as uh, someone with a with a degree in like graphic related stuff with graphic design and whatnot i always i always think the design of characters is really interesting to, to kind of go into and how the origin came about so i just mm -hmm. i had to ask <laughs> yeah all right. Well, um, I guess we'll just go ahead and start calling up some audience members. So, uh, Cookie, do you want to pick the first person? Of course. So let's see. Meeny, miny. Come on, Lug and Shadow. You're up. Welcome, welcome. Hi. Uh, sorry, I was muted. <laughs> it's okay. Hello. Hi, s and I'm a, I'm a huge fan of your work. And I was... So, oh gosh, uh, 
When it's did okay, you take your time. deep breaths? <laughs> okay. So my question to you is how your Sonic OC SNT if it's all right. What was the question? Uh, how old is SNT? Um, okay. Uh, so in, in terms of the creation of SNT, she is, oh gosh, when did I create her? <laughs> I think it was like 2005. So 10, 20, uh, <laughs> about oh, 20 plus years ago. I created her. Gosh, oh my gosh, that just hit me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm old. <laughs> okay. Time flies. Uh, in terms of uh, canonical age, like age in the universe, I I have the same rule as uh, Shadow, where because he is a creation, he is considered ageless. Um, so. Uh, I know this sounds kind of Mary Sue-ish, but she is ageless, like Shadow. Um, but of course, we all know that SNT is a Mary Sue, so. <laughs> yeah. Would that right, well, be... thank you for the question. Yeah, thank Not... you. Keep up the great work, SNT. Okay. All right. I will go ahead and call on the next guest. Let's do um, Bolt the Floof. Bolt the Floof. I, I know there's more. Bolt the Floofy Werewolf. There we go. <laughs> um, Hello. When I was in the middle of eating. <laughs> it's all good. You got a question? Um, yeah. It was about your OC. Like, what inspired you to make your own OC? Uh, let's see. When I was 10 years old, I really liked Sonic a lot. And uh, back then, I had no idea that other people did this. Um, but I was just like, I'm going to make my own Sonic. <laughs> I did that a lot with uh, with the things that I liked. I would just make I would just make characters to fit into the universe and like play with the universe a little bit um and this was before i had like full internet access this was like back in the dial-up days um so i had no idea that uh, other sonic ocs existed uh so <laughs> so i thought i was doing something really unique and different by like creating a, a unique character to fit in the universe um but no <laughs> uh and uh yeah so you know i just i liked sonic a lot and i was playing in in the uh, the playground with my friends and uh we came up with uh the idea of maybe uh, like a like an experiment created by eggman um and i thought that was so unique and cool <laughs> um and and then I went home and then I drew her for the very first time and and the rest is history. <laughs> That's cool. All right. Thank well, thank you. you for the question. Yeah, All thank right. you. All right, Cookie or actually SNT, do you want to pick someone? Um, how about Matthew Prower? All right. All right. Yeah, I already got it. <laughs> hey. Oh, hey. Hello. I just, yeah, I just went to DerpyCon before yesterday, and I saw Chuck E. Cheese and everything, and I'm going to go to this Pepsi pop-up diner event in New York soon, sooner or later. So I'm, uh... Anyways, uh, questions. Um, <laughs> <clears throat> um, are you really going to read Knuckles issues 22 to 24? Because uh, it, 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 it's got some really nasty subjects in there, you know? Well, it's part of the reading order, so if there is a uh, stuff that is uh, yeah. a little a little odd, I, I guess I will uh, do like a like a like a oh gosh, what is it called? Like a content warning? <laughs> yeah, 
Uh, yeah, I know. Also, I kind of find it interesting how, how the Archie side comics and your weird fanfics have very similar things, like Psych being up, up raven haired heard people, uh, angsty characters, um, weird <laughs> power sets, and some and uh, characters being called special. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, I think yeah, I think your first comic had it's... those first S comic had those Galgar like things, like the fourth wall breaking thing. <laughs> It, it, yeah, it's a really awesome. weird coincidence because this is the first time I've ever read these comics. So, <laughs> no, it's so a, well, it's pretty it interesting. Yeah, is very interesting coincidence. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> right, well, thanks for having me along. Uh huh. Let's do some Cell Quo records again. Cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah I like Cell Quo. I've never heard of him, but I'm I'm sure that you will have a fun time. Mm, yeah, all right, cool. Bye. Then. <laughs> Bye. All right, Cookie, you want to go ahead and pick the next person? Of course. So let's ring up Art of Aces. Come on, right up. Hello. Hey, what's up? Can you hear me? Yeah. yeah. Awesome. Awesome. Well, uh, it's a pleasure to meet some of you guys. I know I've seen Kelp around here before. s and Courtney. Uh, I loved your recent collaboration with Belana Productions for the reanimated fanfic. That was amazing. What was oh, it so like? Thank you. Yeah. What was it like orchestrating such a, uh, a big project? Oh, man, it was quite an experience. It's something I've always wanted to do. Um, make like a like a, a reanimated of some of sorts because i i love reanimated collaborations um and i never knew what i was gonna do because i was just like i i have no ideas but then one day i was like wait a second what if i reanimate the best video of all time mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> nice. and, and so then i I messaged uh, Belina and I was like, hey, do you mind if I do this? And, and he was like, oh, my God, that's a great idea. Go for it. And I was like really hyped about that. I was happy to get like his blessing for it. Um, and, uh, you know, then it, it was all. Uh, business, 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 orchestration, orchestrating, <laughs> orchestrating. That's a hard word to say right now. Um, <laughs> uh, getting all of the animators together, I, you know, I pulled, I put like a call out for uh, for animators and stuff. Um, it, it was really cool to work with all of these really talented people. Um, like when I when I saw, I think my one of my favorite shots is uh, Me Tunes a shot where he's like, I I'm going to destroy the Chaos Emeralds to make rock candy. Yes. That's the, <laughs> the it's and if, the first time I saw that I I my jaw was on the floor. I was just like, this is part of a thing that I orchestrated. That that's insane. <laughs> Yeah, it was and it was fantastic. Everybody uh, who was involved did like an amazing job. It they did. It was it was so so cool to do. <laughs> yeah. Well, thanks for having me up. Thanks for answering my question. You guys have a fantastic rest of the con. You as well. Thank yes, you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Uh, I will go ahead and call up Sonic Player nineteen ninety five. Come on. Hey. Hello. Courtney. Hey there. Hello. Welcome. It's good to see you again in this convention. Mm-hmm. Of course. Uh, you got a question? So my, yeah, my question. Um, is there, a, I know you said, I remember in your old views, they said you were inspired by like cartoons, but what about a voice actor, actress is why you want to do voice acting? Uh, what was the question? Well, I'm saying um, this. Oh, sorry. Uh, do you? Have, I think it was. Are you, are you inspired by a voice actor? Am I inspired by a voice actor? No. Oh, who inspired you to be a voice who, actor? Sorry. Oh, who inspired me to be a voice actor? Yeah, okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I get it. I get it. <laughs> Sorry, the the connection's a little weird. Um. Uh. Well, I again, I I was really into cartoons, and I still am. As uh, as a kid, I like I. 
I was fascinated by the uh, creation of cartoons and stuff. And then I started learning about voice acting and uh, I it was fun to like recognize other voice actors in specific cartoons outside of what they're usually known for. Like Tom Kenny, for example. Um, mm. I would, I would like recognize him everywhere. And I was just like, there he is. <laughs> and it, like, it fascinated me to, uh, to the point where when I was making random Pookie adventures, I uh, really wanted to do my own voice acting. <laughs> so that was like the first time I like dabbled in it. Um, and then uh, in college, I took a couple acting classes and that really like helped me advance my skills. I highly recommend doing that if you if you want to get into voice acting. Oh, yeah. If I'm, you can. I'm, I'm take an acting class it really helps all right yeah thanks for the info mm -hmm. um okay um that'll be my question for and uh, thank you uh, snt uh, courtney for being an inspiration to everyone here oh thank you and hope you have a happy <laughs> halloween because halloween is awesome bye oh, it is. yes <laughs> thank you for your question yeah thanks for the question all right snt you want to pick someone Ooh, let's see. I shall pick Harris Boy because right. I, I recognize right them. Hello. Yeah. hello, 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 hello again, um, Courtney. How 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 have you been? I've been good. <laughs> That's great to hear. Um, so my question: um, currently, you've been starting fresh and focusing on your focus, focusing on streaming on your ST live channel. Um, mm -hmm. In your personal opinion, how, how has doing those been helping with um, regaining inspiration? Um, it's definitely uh, given me a bit more freedom to experiment. Because um, on my main channel, uh, it's really hard to experiment with different things besides, you know, my main, my main staples like, you know, Sylveon Trolls all of my s &T stuff um but on s &T live i can like if i have an idea for a stream and it's something completely different usually people will watch anyway and it, it really helps me uh like just play with different ideas and just like be a little more loosey-goosey with it yeah <laughs> okay <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> okay, that, that's that's great. That's great. Uh, thank thank you for answering my uh, question, Courtney. I'm looking forward um, to your next to your next streams. <laughs> they will be back in November. All right. Excited, thank you. Excited for it. All right. Thank you. Thank you for your question, Harris boy. All right, uh, Cookie. You want to go ahead and pick? Of course. Let's go with Trey Thurton. Come right up. Hello. Um, um hello. <laughs> hello. Hi, Trey. Hello, s and It's uh, nice to see you again from probably almost two years, I think. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, my uh, question is for you, Courtney, is... Have you ever heard of Powerpuff Girls? <laughs> oh, I loved Powerpuff Girls as a child. My favorite was Bubbles, of course. <laughs> 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 I was really into Cartoon Network as a kid. Like when we when we finally got Cartoon Network, I was like like hypnotized by it, especially the Powerpuff Girls. Wow, that's great. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you for the question. No problem. Have a great day. You too. Yes, wow. All right. We'll go ahead and call up the next person. Let's go with Shadow R. Hello. 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 Hi, guys. It's great to see you, SNT. And 
I'm a really big fan of one of your videos, and I love your redesigning videos. It helps a lot with my work. Oh, thank you. I'm glad to hear it. Oh, no problem. And also, I have this important question I just thought of when I imagine watching your streams. Um, if SOT were to have a palace or a, in the metaverse, what do you think she would desire? Like, example, like for me, mine would be like a theme park or a cruise ship. Oh, uh, who? I I really don't know. Uh, I'm not really familiar with this um kind of thing. What it? What was I it? Think it was, well, I, think I thought of this idea. I think it's referencing Persona. Persona. Like Persona? Is that the case? Yeah. Oh, Persona. I've never played Persona. So I, I'm not familiar with the, the lore of Persona, unfortunately. All right. Well, That's thanks for right. the question. <laughs> no problem. And I hope you'll do well on the redesignings and your streams. And yeah. I'll anytime you're streaming next month. Okay. All righty. Uh, Courtney, you want to pick one? Uh, how about drowsiest? I can't read the rest, but drowsiest. <laughs> drowsiest rocket. I'm not sure. I think that's right. Drowsiest yeah, drowsiest rocket. rocket. Hey there. Yeah. <laughs> hey, what's up? Hey, uh, I can't really hear you. Yeah, we can. We can't really hear we you. Can't hear you. Yeah. All right. Is this better? Yeah, yeah it's much better. better. There we go. Ah. We go. Right, so, uh, to SNT, uh, how did you get into art? How did I get into art? Yep. Or well, what made you an artist in the first place? Uh, well, when I was a child. I would watch Disney movies and then uh, I, I would look at the VHS cover and I would try to draw uh, the cover from like just by eyeballing it. And, um, <laughs> and then my parents were like, how did you do that? And I was just like, I drew it. And then uh, I just kept drawing and then I eventually would just draw whatever I wanted and um, <laughs> and it just it just developed into an, an artistic tendency, I guess. <laughs> I've been drawing for a very long time, so <laughs> that's an interesting fact. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. well, All right. Thank you for the question. Thank you for your question, Jocist. Uh-huh. And how oh, we get some uh, ice cream sudden like you recreated before. <laughs> <laughs> right. Um, Cookie, you want to go ahead? Of course. And this one is a special for you. Come yeah. on, oh. Ultimate. <laughs> oh, great. <laughs> hey, hold on. When did I become special? I was not informed of this decision. Um, I, want, I, I, I like my lawyer, please. <laughs> <laughs> but it's a All good right, thing. All right, Ultimate. What's your question? Okay. <laughs> um, I gotta make sure first. Have you played any of the Zelda games? Uh, not really. No. <laughs> Crap. All right. Of the ones you've played, which what was your favorite character? You would say out of them. Uh, my favorite character. I really like Gruus. <laughs> okay, I know exactly what game you played. <laughs> you played Skyward Sword. <laughs> I like the memes. I like the Gruus memes. Ah. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> only, only for the memes. Okay. <laughs> Certified gross moment. Anyway, thank you for the question, Ultimate. I should have thought of something more constructive. That's okay. All right. <laughs> but, uh, any question is a good question, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> I suppose. I like All answering right, uh, questions. I'll go ahead and call up Baba. Coming up. Baba. Oh, man, I need to process. Oh, Hello. Wow. Hello. Hello. Hi. Um, I need to stop it to birth. 
Uh, you got a question? <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. I'm just overwhelmed. Uh, hi. That's all good. Um, it's, it's okay. okay. Sorry, it's just a, a struggle with things like this. I'm sorry. Uh, uh, <laughs> if, if I remember correctly, like, uh, I've heard bits and pieces of your work, like, uh, before, but what really got me hooked was s and Forces or whatever it was. Uh, my question to you is, um, how did you come up with that, with the concept of that, and what inspired you to do so? If that's so, oh, uh, so when we'll Sonic Forces, with, um, we'll probably have to go with just one for the sake of time. So, yeah, only that only one yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll go with the one. Yeah, yeah that's so all good. It's okay. I'll, I'll go with the first one. So, how I came up with uh, the concept of ST Forces. So, when Sonic Forces came out, or when it was coming out, I was very excited because, uh, you know, it's got the custom character in it. And um, mm -hmm. at the time, I had uh, like a day job. Um, and I, I would spend a lot of time at this day job, like thinking about Sonic Forces and like, what could it be? How do you think it would work? And then I got it and I played through it um and uh i don't know something clicked in my brain where i was like i should make i should make this into like a story where snt is in this universe and sh her her specialness is like messing with the, the timeline <laughs> and I love that, at first that yeah, at first it was gonna be just her, um, but then I was like, "That that sounds really hard to write because she's not she's not able to bounce off of another person." So then I thought of the uh, the character that they use to advertise Sonic Forces, the the rookie, quote unquote, and I was like. I should turn this person into a secondary character for SNT to bounce off of. Um, and then I wrote it and I was like, wow, aha, this is actually kind of good. <laughs> and I got, I, I, yeah, and then every, and then it, it just happened. <laughs> it, <laughs> editing all of that was a blur. <laughs> <laughs> hey, at least you probably had fun with it. I did. It was. It's one of the most fun things I've ever uh, made. I feel like it's my one of my favorite things. Mm. Uh, I'm glad you actually did make it because that I, I was thinking of doing the same thing when it came out as well. So you're not alone in that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you for your question, Bopa. You're welcome. You. Have a good day. Thank you. Right. All right. All right. So, let's whose see. Turn is it again? Uh, I, I kind of drew a blank. Whose turn is it again? <laughs> I think it might be uh, my turn. I, wait, I think it was s &T, then it was me, and then it yeah, was you. Yeah, right, right, because I called up Bapa. Okay, uh, Courtney, you want to pick someone? Uh, yeah. How about... The Red Spike 17. The Come right with up. The, with a giant lizard. <laughs> that is a large Hello. lizard. Hello. It's the Komodo dragon. Yeah, Komodo oh, yeah, dragon. It is pretty big. Yeah. <laughs> um, pretty big. Uh, what's your favorite uh, Sonic game? My favorite Sonic game? Probably Sonic Forces. I know that's like a what? wild pick. <laughs> <laughs> It, I mean, but I have it has sentimental value for me because of S and T oh. forces. So, because <laughs> I like how you're able to like come up with your character or such, like how it came to be, really. Oh no, my my character has been around for years. I just oh. I just inserted her into the into the world my my way. <laughs> okay, so it was just like. A, like your dream of making your character like uh you know yes. part of Sonic adventures and such. Cool. Yeah. Neat. <laughs> Alrighty. That's just my question. Thanks. 
Sure. Thank you for your question. Thanks for the question. All right. Let's see here. Um, I'm going to go ahead and call up. Go with Maito. Come on up, Maito. Hello. Hello there. Hello. Hey, hey uh, Courtney. Long time to see. It's been. It's good to talk to you again after last year's panel. Oh, cool. Okay, so here's my question. Um, out of all the SNT VTuber models over the last years, which one is your most favorite? Probably the the idol angel one. <laughs> Magical because, idol. <laughs> yeah, it, it's definitely my favorite, um, especially uh, with the addition of it being able to go super. Um, but uh, we will see if that uh, if that opinion changes with the addition of a model coming soon. But right now, Ooh. it is it is the magical idol SNT model. Yeah, it's also my favorite. Hmm. <laughs> All right. Thanks for the well, thank question. You for, your for answering me. it. Yeah, you're welcome. Thanks. Thank All right, you. Have a good day. Yeah. Okay. Thanks. Let's see here. Uh, let's choose Mike Saver. Come right up. Oh. A Hi. pleasure to meet you. Uh, now. I have a question in regards to your character. What is her favorite anime? Assuming if she has a favorite anime. What is SNT's favorite anime? Yeah. Um. Hmm. Oh, that's that's a tough one. What would she like? <laughs> what would she like? What would she probably Tokyo Mew Mew? Oh, that's a good one. But even though I haven't really heard about it. <laughs> <laughs> it's one of my favorites, too. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Although I haven't really seen the anime. but Plus, the only anime I've seen was Dragon Ball Super. Because <laughs> it's my personal favorite. Super Saiyan Blue. The... Mm -hmm. The... Uh, the uh, action sequences... The uh, lore. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Now, if you want to check it out, I re I recommend the original Dragon Ball. Then I've seen Dragon a couple Ball. episodes of that a long time ago, mind you. Huh. Um, <laughs> it was back when it was on Toonami, but uh, yeah. Huh. Also, your character is. Is in is one of the supporting characters oh. of my series, my Sonic uh, series. Only, we only, only have time one, for one question. For one question so per person. Oh, I have to move okay. on. Uh, yeah, my bad. Yeah. Uh, it's okay. All right. Thank you. Thank you Anytime. for your question, Mike. All right. Um, whose turn is it? <laughs> I think it was my <laughs> turn. Take. Sorry, it I've was been... me, and now it's S and T. All right. Oh gosh, uh, Parappa. All right. Um, yeah, sorry, right I didn't with some other conversations. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. <laughs> wow. Hello. Um, first of all, um, this is my first time talking with you, and I'm also done one Woody guy from the Roblox stream. Oh, and, um, I remember you. Yeah. Um, anyway, um, so what was your inspiration for the for the redesign before the Idol Angel and Doctor S and T and shit? Sorry. <laughs> uh, well, as I've said before, I like playing with uh, alternate universes, and uh, I like making outfits. Um, so, uh, I was just playing around on, cause I, I have like a, I have like a cheat sheet, um, uh, that I use that's just S and T, but like with no clothes and I can just draw on the clothes. Um, it's really helpful. And I just, uh, I drew the idol outfit 
and I fell in love with it and I was just like can this be a model I really want this to be a model and then I I showed it to uh, Daniela QDT cat and she was like give me some money I'll make it a model <laughs> As with Dr. S&T, uh, I really wanted to do something special for Halloween because Halloween is my favorite holiday. Um, so I wanted to do like, what if S&T was evil? Like, what if what if she was evil for a month? Um, and then I came up with the alternate universe S&T where she is uh, she's a mad scientist. I really like the mad scientist aesthetic. Um, I actually drew S&T as a mad scientist like a couple years before the Dr. S&T design, but it was just like a costume for her. Um, then I turned her into an actual character and, uh, and then I, and she's a lot of fun to, to play. So <laughs> yeah, I really like the um, Doctor SNT streams. Mm -hmm. well, and overall, SNT stream is really enjoyable. And um, while it did kind of kind of got in front of your content, it really, really was enjoyable and sh stuff. And mm -hmm. one more question. I know. Uh, no, that... we can't have another question. I'm sorry. Yeah, I know that. Only. Sorry. Only one question one per, per person. Per person. Just one more thing before I go. Um, gonna post it in the <laughs> Sorry, we only have time for one question per person. Please respect that rule. Thank you. All right. Um, I guess I guess it's my turn, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. I will call on Amadeus. 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 Hey, my wife is actually working the first time ever now. <laughs> wow. <laughs> that energy. <laughs> yeah. Discord's been tricky. That's how it goes sometimes. Yeah. But uh, yeah. hey there. Oh my goodness, it's actually working. Anyways, um, my question. Um, <laughs> so if SNT was to start exploring other universes, um, which was the first? What would the fir first one be, and why? Ooh, if she started exploring other universes, uh, hmm, think, think, think. <laughs> I mean, she already kind of explores the, uh, I, I call it the Sonic Song universe, um, <laughs> and that's always a fun time, but if it, yeah. if you mean, like, non-Sonic universes? Yes, I mean non-Sonic. Ooh, ooh, th that's a tough one. <laughs> yeah, maybe the, the first one I would maybe think in my head is Mega Man. <laughs> maybe I I'm not really into wide. Mega Man, but it, it I I, I would understand the, the Archie crossover they did. Yeah, um, maybe like the Dungeons and Dragons universe. Ooh, yeah, actually that was yeah. Be <laughs> Have her explore a uh, Faerun mm -hmm. and go on an adventure. Yeah, that, that sounds cool. Yeah. <laughs> right. Yeah, that was my question. Um, I've been a big fan of your work. You were the inspiration for making my OC. So nice. That's, that's great. Um. Uh, nice. Anyway, see you. Bye. Thank you for the question. Thank you for your question. All right. Who's next? I think it's uh, is it Cookie? It's, it's you. Yeah, it's me. Let's right. choose. Lance, come right up. Hello. You're muted. Am I unmuted? Yes, yeah, you now go. you're unmuted. <laughs> okay, that was weird. Eh. Well, I'm here now. <laughs> <laughs> so, my question to you, Courtney, is when it comes to displaying and expressing lore and your character as like a person how do you perceive and understand emotion hmm well uh with snt specifically she's always kind of been a part of me so anything she feels i also feel 
Um, it 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 comes with uh, having a character for so long. You just you just understand them so well that they they feel like a person that you know like personally um so when it comes to like her and expressing emotions it's like i feel what she feels like i know how she feels and it i'm sort of empathetic to that if that makes any sense kind of yeah it it it's really hard to explain because i've had this character for years and it's just like a part of me <laughs> yeah just right, well, uh, thank you for the question no problem it was a very interesting question all right courtney i think it's your turn to pick well there's only one person with their hand up <laughs> All right. Well, I guess it's Chris then. Yeah. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Mic coming in okay? Uh huh. Yeah, your mic's coming in great. Yeah, we can hear you. All right. Uh, so my question for you is, um, what inspired you to make the Sprite comics? Ooh, uh, I actually saw Sprite comics on Neopets. Um, cause on Neopets, you can, uh, your pet comes with its own web page that you can edit the HTML of. And I saw other Sonic, other Sonic, uh, fans post their personal Sprite comics on their, on their Neopets' uh, page. And... I was like, how do you do that? So I, you know, did some Googling. I found out about Sprite Sheets. And uh, and then I I was like, I'm going to make comics with s &T with these sprites because drawing the first comic took forever. So this is much faster. <laughs> And so, and so I did that, and then for a while, those Sprite comics were also up on Neopets. Um, but then, f when I checked again, like, years later, they Neopets deleted all of them. <laughs> but luckily, I had them uh -huh. all... S I had them all saved on a hard drive, so... <laughs> so I have them forever. Yeah, well, that, that's good to know. <laughs> All right. Well, mm -hmm. thank you for the question. Thank no you for problem. your question, good Chris. Day. You too. You too. All right. Seems we got another hand uh, hand up. Uh, feel free to put your hands up. There's still a little bit more time left in this in this uh, Q and A. Um, so we'll go into a second round of questions if there's no new ones, but um, not too many because there's only like 15 minutes left. But I'll go with As for this one. Hello. Hello. Hey. Hello. Uh, Nice to meet you. This Hi. is my first time speaking here. A bit nervous. Well, good. What's yeah. your question? Um, what was your biggest milestone? My biggest milestone? Ooh. When I hit, probably when I hit 100,000. No, no, actually, my biggest milestone was getting a million views on the, uh, the, uh, oh gosh, <laughs> the s &T comic video, the first one. When that thing hit a million views, I was like, that, huh? <laughs> this nice. is real. Let <laughs> right. it, 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 me speak in here. I uh, hope things go well and um, have a nice Halloween. Oh, thank you. Yeah, thanks for the question. Thank you for your question. All right, Cookie, your pick. Let's see. Let's go with Biohazard Studios. All right. I know that guy. Hello. Hey. You're, You're muted. muted. <laughs> Hello? Hello? Oh, no. Are we having the moment Hang on a again? Sec. Let me try something. Wait, I saw green. Oh, no. Hey, there we go. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry about that. My microphone somehow disconnected for some reason. Anyway, um, Courtney, it's uh, great to see you again. I'm just going to make this quick. Uh, my question for you 
Uh, you made a couple of uh, redesigns of uh, other OCs besides SMT that we've seen in the past. Uh, one of them being a singer and all those things. Uh, my question to you will be a will be ah sorry can't speak. Will we ever see these characters again in the near future? Who's to say? <laughs> it depends <laughs> on if I have any inspiration for them. <laughs> uh, currently, I have no ideas, but uh, maybe in the future, who knows? Who's to say? All right. Well, thank you for your question. Great to see you again, Courtney. Thank you guys so much. And uh, mm-hmm. have a good rest of the con. You, you as too. well. Thank you. All right. Uh, Courtney, it's your turn to pick. Ooh, uh, Harris again. <laughs> All righty. Harris, come on up. Second round. Okay. So my second Hello question. Again. Hello again. So second Hello. questions. Um, are there any f- games um, you're currently looking forward to playing uh, for the rest of this year? Or or is it being games um, from this year you've enjoyed playing this year? Ooh, hmm, games that I am looking forward to. Uh, hmm, I don't know, it's, it's hard because like I, I don't really pick up games very often okay. because video games are expensive. Um, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I I'm I'm interested in WarioWare, the new WarioWare. Oh, that yeah. one looks fun. Was it WarioWare Move It? Yes. I think. Yeah. Comes that one looks sa- fun. Yeah, comes out, comes out the same day as Fashion Dreamer, which is the one I'm looking forward to. <laughs> oh, is it? I yeah. had no idea. Yeah, they're, but they're both coming out on the same day. <laughs> it's, it's That's weird. cool. Yeah. Oh. I have to pick one. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you for your question. You're thank welcome. you for your question, Harris. All right, uh, I will go ahead and call back up uh, Sonic Player 1995. Come on up. Well, hello again. <laughs> hello again. We meet again. Uh, okay, here's my question for pointing up. You're a fan of musicals I heard of, Sam. Do you have a particular favorite musical? Beetlejuice. Oh, that's a good <laughs> one. I, uh, just... I saw it in person yeah, in I, June. I, 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 I saw so it on the Twitter. Good. That's awesome. It was, it was so good. I really enjoyed it. <laughs> yeah, because I've been recently interested in musicals as well, so... Okay, I'll be going out. Thank you for my question and have a good day. Uh huh. You too. Have a good day. Yes. Thank you. All right, Cookie, your pick. All right, let's go with Amadeus again. Come right up. Hello. Hello, Amadeus. Oh, no. Oh, no. Whoa, we're, ha- whoa, we're having whoa, another whoa, whoa, moment. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> oh, hold on. Let me, let me try this again. <laughs> Poor Amadeus. This has happened on multiple <laughs> occasions. <laughs> I had to do it the second time I come up. <laughs> you know, that's just Discord for you. Sometimes Discord, this thing happens. Discord doesn't love us. <laughs> <laughs> All right, what's We're your in second a real question? Big server. Um, what would ST's favorite game genre be? What would her favorite game genre be? Probably just simulations. Simulation games, like like those like virtual reality games or something like that. Like, uh, you know, stuff like The Sims and... Oh, oh yeah, the... Uh, like, Tomodachi Life, stuff like that. Animal Crossing? Animal Crossing too. yeah. yeah. I actually remembered you uh, showcased um, pixel art in one of the Dr. S... by pixel art in one of the uh, Dr. s t streams at the end. Oh, yeah! That was, like, a long time ago, and I think I've improved since then, but I still felt really happy when I saw that. I was like... <laughs> right. Yeah. Okay. Well, thank you for the question. Thank you for your question. Day is dark. Is on the for happy day. <laughs> as well. Thank you. <laughs> oh, we remember happy day. <laughs> there you go. That's a that's a deep Word. cut. Words to live by. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Courtney. I think it's your pick. Uh, Lance again. Lance. All right. Hello. Um, 
All right. Hello. We can hear you well. We can hear you. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, it's working yeah. this time. Mm -hmm. All right, you got a question? Yes, I do. So, creative blocks. We all creative hate block. Yes. <laughs> My question is, how do you deal with cr major creative blocks and any tips on how you would get rid of them? Well, the first step I do is step away from what I'm doing. Um, and I, you know, I... I take a break from from the creative process because like creating constantly is not good for you. Um, it really wears you down, which is why uh, being a YouTuber can be like really tough for for a lot of people because you constantly have to make stuff. Um, so what I do is I, I step away from everything. I uh, focus my attention on like things that are still kind of creative but in a way that it's personal like i i really like doing arts and crafts and i like making things with my hands um and i do i don't do this for content i just do this uh to make myself happy um so that like focusing on like another another form of creation is real good uh any co other kind of hobby uh focusing on that is good. it's just good to have hobbies so when you when you feel like creatively drained you can just go to that hobby and just uh chill just chill for a little bit hmm. eventually the creative block will go away and then you'll be fresh and new Thank it you just so much. it takes it just takes time and relaxation. Okay. That's awesome. Hmm. Thank, Thank you, you so for the much. question. Oh, Thank you for welcome. your question, Thank Lance. You. All right. Um, I guess I will call up the next person. Let's go with Chris. Hey, Chris. Hello. Hey, I'm back again. <laughs> Hello again. And luckily for me, I actually had two questions in mind. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, um, was there any story ideas you had in mind, but they couldn't be done? Ooh, yeah, that's a good, that's a good one. There, there is a script that I wrote. Um, it's based on the Sonic and the Black Knight canon. Um, and I, I put a lot of time and effort into the script. However, I do not have the, uh, what's the word? I don't, I have the, I don't have the resources or time to make it into a series. Um, because it is just, it's too grandiose, it's too large. Like, s &T Forces, it was doable because I had, like, a system. Um, but for this particular script, it is too big. <laughs> it is too big for one person, me, to, uh, to handle i guess um but you know i i have it shelved maybe someday i'll do something with it but for now it is shelved i i do like it though <laughs> uh, it'll be interesting to see if it comes out mm -hmm. right. well thank Thanks you for, for the question, question all right i think we have time for i think one, one more, more if it's if it's yeah. quick so um Let's go ahead and and call on the last person. I believe um, I believe it's is it S and T's turn. I think. Yeah, uh, I think we'll go with Parappa because Amadeus already answered two questions. Right. <laughs> Thank you. Um, so um, I know you were making another song. Um, are there any updates yeah. about it? Yeah, it's done. <laughs> it's done i just need to make the music video for it <laughs> oh um are you going to like post it on your patreon or something you know just uh, as a preview I, 
I'll probably uh, I'll probably post like a, a preview of it on Patreon. It's just I've been so busy with with Halloween because I've I've had so yeah, many the things whole to do. Stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but uh, yes, uh, he is a ghost is complete. Um, I just need to make the music video for it, and uh, yeah, I'll maybe next month I'll post like a preview of it for for the patrons. Yeah, it'll definitely be on Spotify. I'll have that set up. All right, all right, good. Well, thank you for the question. Thank you for your question. Did you saw the thing I saw? Oops. (laughs) Sorry, we hold. We we're on a bit of a time crunch here. Yeah. Um, it's like but one anyway, left. thank you all for the questions. Uh, Courtney, do you have anything you want to say to the audience before we head out? Uh, happy Halloween! <laughs> <laughs> all right. That, that's it. <laughs> all right, well, thank you everyone for tuning in to the Q&A with Project SNT. I've been your host, Diet Dr. Kelp, as well as my wonderful co-host, Cookie Star. Thank you so thank much. You. Um, thank you, you everyone. You guys have a great rest of your con. Uh, we will see you later. Take care, everyone. Take care, everyone. Thank you. Bye-bye. Thank you for coming.